Today I'm going to show you how to draw and paint a little bird. First, I'm going to draw the whole shape of the bird, always thinking about the big shape. Okay, here you go. So I'm going to have the bird's wings over here, have a little tail on the back over here. And like that, this would be the big shape of the bird. And I have the little mouth over here. I'm going to have a little dark color here on the top here. And I also have the location for the eye. And she is on um, a little tree branch. Like that. And another one. Like that. That's good. And I have the tree coming over here. That's fine. I'm going to have a little bit coming out like this. So make a little fun. Let me do a little bit detailed drawing. And I think some of you would like to see a little bit more finished drawing before I start the painting. Okay, like that. So this is the mouth and then coming to the head over here, here you go. And the eye, I'm going to have a little white space, a little highlight, much better. Okay, like that. And the legs actually from here coming down like that looks good. I will have the drawing for you to download and look at it and follow the video to draw. Take a look at the wing over here. And as I have a few layers, there's one layer and the bottom of it has another layer. I think the drawing is already finished. And then we're going to start the painting. If you like birds, you must love to see this alphabet poster. The original artwork is a one piece watercolor painting. Click the link over here to open the page. You're going to see this poster after viewing this video. The painting quite small, so I'm going to use this clickety brush to start painting into the bird. First, I'm going to paint a little bit lighter color. So I'm going to have the yellow color mixed with the red color and press a little blue color so make it a little gray. This is good. So first I'm going to paint a little darker, a smaller light tone over here. I'm going to have a little bit more water like that. That's the hair. And maybe a little bit gray so I add a little bit blue color and this is good. Hey. In the front over here, I'm going to have a little bit yellow because I want it to be appear a little bit more orange color. So, a little bit yellow and red color. I have uh, some video talk, ab talk about how to mix colors. So you can follow this to do the exercise of color mixing. It's very easy. Okay, now I'm going to come back with a little bit blue color, a little bit gray color. So, put it on there tail over here and a little bit over here too. Even have a little bit more blue color like that. So this is the foundation color. Uh, and I would do a little bit more uh, details a little bit later. You see how easy for the painting. And now I'm going to add a little uh, gray color like uh, this kind of warm gray color. So I'm going to come in over here, put the color for the legs. That's good. I'll do the tree a little bit later. One thing at a time. It's okay. Like that. Well, that's pretty good. Now I'm going to come to paint a little bit of the mouth. So when you start the painting, 
start from the foundation color. I'm going to leave a little white on the top so you see a little bit highlight. I'm going to mix some really dark color for the top over here. How to mix the very dark color? Just get the red and the blue. It will become very dark, this pleasant blue. I will have the link to the materials in the video description. Okay, now first I'm going to make a little bit lighter first, add a little bit more water. So the top over here would appear a little bit lighter because the light coming down from the top. And I have a, a few lines over here like that. A little bit softer. Like that, that's good. Now, painting around the eye. Okay, that's good. Like that. This brush is very easy to use. Uh, I still have some, a few uh, available for sale. I put the link in the video description if you want to take a look at it. And it's very inexpensive. And the bottom over here, like that. Okay, have a little here. A little dark color too, that's good. And I'm gonna come here, this probably already dry. So I'm gonna put a little dark color here too, to showing uh, different layers of the hair. That's good, like that. A couple line here, that's good. I'm gonna start having little details. I'm going to have it a little bit darker. Just a little red. That's good. There you go. Like that. And I have the thin line. Like this. That's good. Now the wing. This looks almost finished. Like that. Alright, it's pretty easy. Now I'm gonna come down to the lake over here and give a little detail. And between this, each of the fingers have a little gap. Like this. And I'm gonna have, clean my brush, have a little bit lighter color. So I'm gonna show this. There you go, show the texture. Like that. Change the shape a little bit. That's good. And we'll come back to do a little bit more. The color now is getting wet. So I need to get away from that. Um, I will come back a little bit later. Like that. Very easy to do. So they look like a lick. And then the head is getting drier. I'm going to mix the uh, two colors together, the red and the present blue together again. This time the color would be darker. So now I'm going to make the color pop a little bit more compared to the white color next to it. And now and lift the top a little bit lighter, like that. That's good. Like how easy with watercolor. And the bottom over here, I'm gonna make this a little bit darker, like that. Some texture. That's good, like that. Come back here. A little bit darker and a few here. Now it's good. Now what I want to do in the outside over here make it a little bit softer because I want to feel like uh, a very soft bird here. Now I can come into the mouth at this very sharp 
uh, line with this small click of the watercolor brush is really easy. Now I can come into the eye and I'm gonna have a little brown color. So get a little bit red and yellow. It look like a more brown. And first I'm gonna paint it into the eye over here. I'm gonna keep that little highlight in the middle. The watercolor is very easy to keep the highlight. Now I'm gonna paint the tree. I'm gonna have a little bit brown color. Get a little yellow, a little red, that looks like orange color. I get a little blue color, it will look a little bit more brown. That's good. I'm gonna put it on this side, like this first. Here, the bird blocking the light. So it look like a little bit darker in this. I'm gonna leave a little gap, a few in the gap if I want to, a little bit later. Like that. I'm gonna have a little bit blue, so it appear to be a little bit gray. Like that. That's good. Like that. that looks good. Now, what I want. Just use the water on the top over here and make it a little bit softer. So it will show it like uh, uh, some round transition. And the bottom over here, I'm going to use a little bit darker color. So now mix a little bit darker and put over here. So you see the tree a little bit more rounded feeling. I'm gonna have a little bit blue, here you go. Make this side a little bit darker, like that. Okay, that looks good. That's a tree. Now, I'm gonna come back to the both side. Red and the blue color for the dark color. Okay, now I'll take a look. I'm gonna have the edge over here, a little bit darker. Like that, that's good. And I have a little bit darker in the middle of the eye. Ooh, the eye finish. That's very easy. Uh, I'm gonna add a little bit darker color at the edge over here. Give a little texture like this. It's okay, a little texture. To have the yellow color and making this and have a little blue color. Now it make it a lot more like a gray color. Now that's good. I don't need to be very, very dark. So it's just a little bit of this color. That's good. Now I'm going to start now. Just painting the outside of the bird like that. And after you finish this, you're gonna see the bird look totally different because it has a background to help like the tails here, the white showing up and also the belly of the bird will show up. Like this. And then the, I'm gonna make this a little bit darker. I'm gonna make this a little bit darker. It looks like something going on in the background. Now this is your turn. Follow it step by step, you can do the same. Now use the link in the video description to check out the beautiful Birds Alphabet poster. You will love it.